today's topic is how to find the equation of the parabola and in today's lecture we are given with a focus point and here is our directrix line so if we are given with this type of focus point and this directrix line then how to find the equation of the parabola so as we already discussed about the equation of the parabola and different types of the parabola in different situations so if I just plot a rough parabola so what the parabola says that if I suppose that the parabola is open towards the right side means towards the positive axis and the vertex is at origin then here is a focus point then we know that this distance the uh, vertex point and the focus point distance is same to the vertex point to the directrix line and we suppose that here is our directrix line as you see that the vertex is at origin means here is a vertex point that i will say that this is my vertex point here is a focus point and here is a directrix line so if you Notice that the definition of the parabola which we already discussed in previous lectures that if I choose a point over here and I will suppose that this point is A point then the distance between these two points means this distance and this distance is same and if I will suppose that a distance a point P where this line meets this directrix line so basically this is directrix line so by the definition of the parabola which says that this distance is equal to this distance means F A distance which is equal to P A distance and distance is always positive let a point A having coordinate X and Y be a point on parabola as I just draw this parabola in a rough sketch to just memorize about the concept of the parabola and here is a point F which is a focus and if I suppose that this given equation is P. So, what's the parabola says by definition of a parabola? P A distance which is equals to F A distance. So, our first aim if I will calculate this distance means F A distance so here is a focus point which is known and here is a point having coordinate X and Y so we just apply a distance formula between these two points so in my first step if I calculate the distance which is F A this is my first point so how I will calculate it that at the first point x minus then the other point which is minus 3 square plus y minus 4 the other term which is 4 square with this radical sign so if I take uh, another step which is x plus 3 square plus y minus 4 square with this radical sign and this is my first step which I calculate this and I will say that this is my first equation now to find the equation of the ellipse what we need the other thing is that to find the distance between PA means this point and this line say that write the equation which is 3x minus 4y plus 5 with modulo divided by the scale of the coefficients of x and y as you see that 3 scale the sign is plus and the coefficient of y is minus 4 so I will take the scale of minus 4 and this whole term is in a radical sign basically this is a formula which we frequently use in previous videos so it will be 3x 
माइनस फोर वाई प्लस फाइव एंड दिस विथ मैग्नीट्यूड साइन डिवाइडेड बाई इट विल बी नाइन प्लस फोर स्केयर इट विल बी सिक्सटीन विथ दिस रेडिकल साइन सो इन फर्दर स्टेप आई विल कैलकुलेट दिस फाइनल वैल्यू विच डिवाइडेड बाई ट्वेंटी फाइव विथ दिस रेडिकल साइन और वी कैन राइट इट एज थ्री एक्स माइनस फोर वाई प्लस फाइव विद दिस डिवाइडेड बाई विद एब्सिल्यूट वैल्यू विच इज फाइव एंड दिस इज माई सेकेंड इक्वेशन विच इज पी ए सो आई पुट दीज टू इक्वेशन इन माई ए इक्वेशन एट आई राइट इट पुट वन एंड सेकेंड इन ए सो आफ्टर दिस to putting this value so i will say these two equations are equal in other words so it will be x plus 3 square plus y minus 4 square with this radical sign which is equals to 3x minus 4y plus 5 with absolute value divided by 5 so what we do in our next step to reach out the equation of the parabola so there is only one step that we take a squares on both side to just get up rid of this radical sign so if i take square on both sides then i will get x plus 3 square plus y minus 4 square which is equal to this whole term is in square means 3x minus 4y plus 5 square divided by this 5 is in square so i will write in this way as i open the square of this factor so i will get x square plus 6x plus 9 plus and if i open this square i will get y square minus 8y plus 16 on this side if i open this square so i will get 9x square plus 16y square Plus twenty five minus twenty four x y plus thirty x minus forty y and divided by five square, which is twenty five. In our next step, if y if I multiply twenty five on both sides, so what I get? So I will get twenty five x square plus six x plus Nine plus y square minus eight y plus sixteen, which is equal to this whole term, which is nine x square plus sixteen y square plus twenty five minus twenty four x y plus thirty x and minus forty y. So if you solve all these equations, so what we finally conclude the equation, which is sixteen x square. Plus twenty four x y plus nine y square plus one twenty x minus one sixteen y plus six hundred, which is equals to zero. And basically, this is the required equation of the parabola. So here is a complete procedure that how to find the equation of a parabola when we are given this focus point and this directed line. 